Ahoy ahoy! We're back with Pokemon Fire Red. And I think we were going to take on the gym today. I'll s I trained up a bit, so we'll see. See how that goes. Uh, probably didn't train up quite enough, but. Hopefully, I don't just die. Eh. I would feel a lot better if that wasn't a crit. Anyway, uh, I know I missed the last two weeks, but with school starting and everything, it's kind of hard to kind of hard to find time to do everything. And uh, obviously, school is a bit more important. Okay. But yeah, uh, yeah, sorry I missed the... <laughs> I'm sorry what I subjected you to at the end of the last episode. Seemed like a good idea at the time. Oh yeah, if you don't know, this is full of, inv of invisible walls. Except that you can see the... Uh, there's like four white dots at the edge of each square that has the the walls. So that's how you can tell. It was really hard to tell on a on a Game Boy screen. You know, in Pokemon Red and Blue, whenever the screen wasn't lit up, you could barely see anything anyways. It's supposed to be a poison type gym, but everybody uses psychic Pokemon for some reason. Except for the leader, of course. I can see a reflection of the screen in my glasses. Either that or that's a video error. So let's see. Let's see how far I can make it today. And by today I mean this whole recording session. I'm not sure how many more opportunities I'm gonna have while school's going on. Uh, sorry, Beowulf. Oh, I forgot Drowsy's, like, pathetic. Alrighty. In case you didn't notice, I shaved my beard off. No, I didn't lose a bet. We are in the middle of filming... Uh... If you look at my videos, there'll be a trailer for a movie called Soul Catcher, which is something Aaron and Ethan invented probably a decade ago or so. Not exactly sure about the date, because the 2012 that I thought it was is probably wrong. Um, but yeah, I'm... We're filming that, and I didn't think my character would have a beard, so I shaved it off. And now... It's grown back pretty quick, but I'll have to shave it off to continue filming, obviously. I ordered some... Some, like, wigs and things. I got some... Uh... Silver hairspray to... Age some people up. Because... We're gonna have to double up on parts, probably. At least some of us. Probably me. I got a little over-ambitious with the script. So... I think there's more people in the script than, I, and than people I know. Or at least people who are willing to act. <laughs> Let's see, before I forget, I better do a band of the day. Um. Mm. Uh, I'll go with. I'll go with Blur today. Why? They're 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 okay. It's not my favorite band in the world, but 
uh, they got they got a couple songs that I really like. Um, song two, originally originally named, and uh, they got. Man, I can't remember names of songs today. Um, what else does Blur do? They got the song "Girls and Boys," which is okay, but the bass part of that's really cool. And then "Charmless Man." Or, yeah, Charmless Man. I always get confused because the killer... Not the killers. Let me start over. <laughs> Blur has the song Charmless Man, which I get confused with the Smiths song, Charming Man. This Charming Man. <laughs> I'm doing smashing. How are you? <laughs> shouldn't be this tired, it's like one o'clock. Oh well. Uh, the Happy Town Murders came out yesterday. Which means I'm filming this Saturday. So you'll see this in six days, so it means nothing to you. It, lo it looks pretty funny. <laughs> I know Aaron wants to see it, so I'll probably end up Seeing it before too long. Maybe tonight. See how that goes. Anyway, uh, I hope you guys are having a good time back at school. I'm all alone. It's just me. Me, the high schoolers, and Aaron in town. I guess Sarah might still be in town. I don't know. Yeah, I think... Eh, not important. <laughs> She is or she isn't? No. Yeah, sh she's still in town. Sarah, I didn't mean that you aren't important. Cole, I didn't mean Sarah's not important. Don't beat me up. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we're fighting a sand slash now. <clears throat> Se seamless, seamless segue there. So, uh, I'm almost done with the script to Soul Catcher. I know, I know I said that last time, and I added like eight more pages, and I'm still saying I'm almost done. But it's, it's almost done. <laughs> and then, I gotta find people to play the parts, and then I gotta film it. Uh... I have a couple parts that are for people of the female persuasion. If you are of the female persuasion and you would like a part, you well, if you want a part, you're pretty much guaranteed to get a part anyways. <laughs> so if you want a part, hit me up. Yeah, it, it's it's going pretty good. There's a little tonal inconsistency. Like most of it's pretty serious, but I added there's quite a bit of humor. It just comes out because of the way I write. It's very strange. I've changed my writing style a lot. But the uh A bit of comedy just kind of came through. I'm not saying I'm the funniest person in the world, but... I have my moments and most of them are accidental, we'll just say that. <laughs> and then it just kind of comes in with the way people play the roles, you know? You know, what, um... I, I wrote the character of Halliday, which is Wesley's character, be kind of funny anyways, but then... The way he plays it, it's just... It's really funny. <laughs> so it, it's a really good time.
if only actually getting everything together for the filming was as fun as filming with the people. Because <laughs> it's always going to be a good time with Sarah and Cole, Ethan, Wesley. It's always going to be a great time, but... You know, finding time to do it and getting all the technology set up and... Me being the absolute professional that I am, I never remember to do anything. And I'm not a very good director. I'm just like, hey, here, here's the lines. Y y your character's kind of like this. Go. <laughs> Which is fine. It just means that I can never direct people that I don't know. Because I, I can get away with it because I know the people who are playing the roles. And I know that they can do it. And I know that they can do it better if they decide for themselves and if I try to tell them what to do. I'm a very, uh, non-authoritarian director. <laughs> and I'm fighting the gym. I was just kind of going, uh... This is pretty dangerous, actually. I think his highest is like a level 40, uh, wheezing. Watch, it's gonna work immediately for this guy. Oh no, he's gonna heal! Excuse me. Well, time to do all that again. <laughs> You're in for a long ride. I hate fighting Koga. I should have gotten at least critical up a couple levels. Probably Barney too. Another hyper potion. Probably. Yeah. I hate this game. I need to stay where the camera's focused. I keep moving around too much. Do I? Whatever. What else you get? Oh. Did I teach anybody anything they can never miss? I don't think so. I knew I was gonna... This thing's never dying. Get a crit. Get a critical. Or just get a high roll. That works too. Ah, uh, Gross. He throwed his sludge on me. And you missed! How do you miss at this critical junction? You know, I'll keep the poison just so I don't get toxic. I don't really need a hyper potion. Wait, I'm. How much did that sludge do? It was a lot, right? Yeah, as in, if I take one more, I'm dead. And I think I'm slower. What do I do now? Immune. Mm. Oh my gosh, stop! I hate this game. I hate this game! It only works against me. Thank you. Gosh, it's still not gonna be dead. Or it will. Smog's just that much stronger and critical. Well, if I if I would have known I had easy mode the whole time, why would I waste time with critical? I'm sorry, Cole. 
Porygon's not a very good Pokemon. <laughs> I spent five hours <laughs> getting the coins for that thing. Oh, I guess I should, uh, adjust the elephant on the screen, so to speak. I changed the layout, and I missed two weeks because I had to... I was having some real bad computer problems. I don't know what happened, but, like, on my desktop, none of the, uh, none of the icons would show up. It'd just be the name of the application. I was trying to figure out what to do and I finally just decided to reinstall Windows on my computer. So I backed up all my files. Well, almost everything. I missed some things. Because I'm, I'm stupid. But I did that and reinstalled Windows so I obviously... I'm sure there's a way to do it but I didn't, I didn't think about it. But I lost all my layouts on on OBS. So I had to remake the layout and I was lazy about it and school was starting so I missed two weeks. I can surf now. Hmm. Yeah, I think I made a a little bit better layout. It's not bad. I have Pokeballs on the bottom now instead of just Triangles. <laughs> looks good, looks good. Mm. Well, we got a badge, and it's been 17 minutes. You know what? Time for a badge bonus round. Not really a badge, but. Hmm. I'll use Barney. A gym bonus round. Now I know what you're thinking. The gym's closed. But what you don't know is there's a fighting dojo. Oh, I already fought a dude in here. Hmm. I might use... Hmm. I might use Hitmonlee or Hitmonchan. Which one? I could leave it up to you, but... Then I'd have to wait until this one was uploaded to film the next. Or I could just text Cole. But he's probably working, which means it'd be a while anyways. But if I text him, eat lunch, come back, and if he doesn't respond, I pick. Rage! Yay. Yeah. So I need to think of a solo game to play next. I guess I can continue Link of the Past. Link of the Past. Link, Link to the Past. That's the name of that game. <laughs> Since Ethan doesn't want to do it anymore and he's kind of out of state, <laughs> I could do that. I'm not sure if I'll be able to finish that game though. I've never beat it before. My knowledge trails off after like the next temple. <laughs> So since I had to redo everything, I had to redo the green screen, and I remember why I would always say, eh, good enough. I at least got the motion blur off, because it was really bad earlier. Like every time I'd move, you just see a bunch of green. Now you just see a bunch of weird pixely shapes. It's an improvement from just a blot of green, I suppose.
What's this guy's name? Hit, hit, Hitoshi. Man, Barney is, Barney's pretty strong. My only memory of, uh, Exeggidors is fighting them, so... Using one's a nice change of pace. Oof, I give up. What am I gonna do for Sabrina? I have a poison type, which is weak. I'm about to get a fighting type, which is weak. I could go get a steel type. The only steel type in the game. just let uh, Smaug power through everything like like he's been doing this entire game. There's always that option. Critical... Critical won't be bad. <laughs> Look at the uh, the headphone right here. It's there. It disappeared. There. Disappeared. I'm easily amused. Ha, <laughs> I just beat Aaron. <laughs> yeah, stubbed fingers. Yeah, Aaron would join a, jo join a dojo to say that he was cool and then quit because he stubbed his fingers. I believe it. I don't remember the last time I've said something nice about Aaron. Probably years. Aaron, you're a... You're a good... You're a good sport. <laughs> Karunto! I am the Karate Amatara! That's, that's really racist. Sorry about that, Jim! I'm not gonna do that anymore. <laughs> I probably will, but, uh... I don't... I'm not... I'm not racist. As far as you know. That's a bad thing put on the internet. I'm not racist. <laughs> Barney might be racist. <laughs> oh, gosh. Don't freeze me. Anything but freeze me. <laughs> okay. What a strange battle. A crit, a frozen, first term defrost, and then a confusion. The RNG gods are going wild today. Yeah, go Barney. Hydra beaten! See, I changed the accent from, uh, from Japanese stereotype to not Hitmon Lee or Hitmon Chan. Maybe I'll decide next time on Fire Red Z. Bye!